Well, hello there. Just a quick vlog on what I got today at the thrift store. Uh, I got a lot of stuff. Well, not a lot of stuff, just three things. But three amazing things. Um, I got, first of all, this. This TV is a Levis 517B. It is a black and white television. Uh, I think it is a model from 1968. And it is all tube based. It is all tube based. And impressively enough it works I know you shouldn't do this because of the risk of uh, the main filter caps exploding and all that but let's let all of those tubes in there light up you can see the filaments Getting warmer. Wait for it. It'll eventually go on. Here we go. Hey, hey. As you can see, it works. Got a channel clunker on VHF. And on UHF, it's got a little vernier. Yeah. But that's not the main thing that I bought. Let's turn it off before the main caps explode on the thing. Let's unplug it. Oh, uh, Levis, by the way, is a Spanish brand. This was made in Barcelona. Uh. Yeah, pretty freaking cool. It has these uh, weird connectors for the antenna, which I don't have a clue what they are, uh, but I'll figure that out. Uh, yeah, channel clunker for VHF, right here, 1 through 12. Fine on course. Uh, tuner for UHF. There we go. But let's see what I what else I found. And that is inside this box. I mean inside this bag. This Although it is missing the eyepiece, the rubber eyepiece, is another Polaroid Supercolor 635. Another one. I already have one, but th this one is to give away. This one I'm going to give away to a friend of mine, which uh, she loves photography, and she's been... Uh, She's been behind a Polaroid for quite a long time, and these things, these things have inflated in, in price lately a lot, thanks to the Impossible Project, which, yeah, film packs and everything. Uh, thanks to the Impossible Project, I am able to actually take pictures 
with my Polaroid. So yeah, that is awesome. I have to check if it works at all. It probably does. I mean, there's not much that can go wrong on these things. So yeah, this is for a friend of mine. And something a little bit more rare that I found is another instant camera is this. This is a Kodak EK160EF. I have no clue. Uh, about this, about what this is, or anything like that, I mean, I've got no clue, I have never seen one of these, I have never seen one of these before, I have no clue how to operate one of these, uh, yeah, I, uh, uh, I had never seen one of these, nor heard about one of these before but yeah it seems to have the strap on it uh, battery cover sadly is missing but it seems to take four double A's eyepiece is there and it's not decomposing it has a tripod mount which is something and it takes uh, let me open it up. It seems to take these cartridges, these film packs. PR14410. Yeah, these have nothing to do with Polaroid's uh, cartridges. And I don't know if those are still being manufactured or not. Uh, probably not, I am guessing. Let me take uh, the old film pack out of this Polaroid. This has no... Yeah. This has... This is empty. So yeah, as you can see, quite a different format so you can't just throw a Polaroid cart in there sadly you can't just throw a Polaroid cart in there uh, yeah maybe you can fill these up with uh, Instax film or something uh, I don't know I will have to check M maybe they are even still in production I mean who knows but yeah I will have to check but yeah the, this is the, the first find I don't know how much these are worth I don't know if they are worth anything I paid five bucks for for this one I paid five euro for the 635 five euro for these um, AK160 and 10 euro for the TV expect a video on the TV I will be uh, recapping it at least the main filler filter caps and I will be building a computer with a composite output and an RF modulator just to uh, make it play some things. So yeah, that's about it. Uh, if anyone, if anyone has any clue what this camera is is all about, and oh, by the way, the flash extends out like this <laughs> no clue why but the flash just extends out like that so yeah if anyone has any clue what this camera is all about just leave something in the comments so yeah that's about it uh, 
right day in the thrift store so you know comment like subscribe whatever and bye